Esports is a growing industry. It's coming into the near billion market right now. With this course, it's basically my 20 years experience put into a course. So as I started as a player, and when I retired as a player, I went on to be a manager, a coach, and also doing events. So it's everything that I did for the last 20 years is into this. In esports, it's very diverse. So you can go from, if you want to be a player, you can be a player, but if you retire like I did, what else is there can you possibly do? Do you want to leave the team? Do you want to go do something else? These are the possibilities that you have to think about. We're not just focused on one part of esports, we focus on everything from being a player to being coach manager, but also the event side of it. So if you want to run your own events, uh, in the background, you know, or marketing, branding, you name it. Um, there's all these sort of diverse roles that are in esports that we can learn here. And you get to develop as well. Everything that we do here is more student led. I mean, even though I've been in the sort of scene for 20 years, my sort of side of it in terms of lecturing is more guidance. Right or wrong, it doesn't matter. They have to explore what is right and wrong as well. So it gives them that sort of decision making, those sort of project management skills, you name it, it's all being worked here. For me, teaching it to younger generation now is probably the best because I can go through all my experiences and knowledge of what I did bad, and I can actually teach now uh, that and make it right for the newer generation. Being at the, the Tech Park, you know, it's a phenomenal building. If you haven't been here, it's, it's worth a look because it's not just the, the gaming here, but animation and film and sound, you name it, it's all here in this Tech Park. Uh, for these students who want to get into it, it is a perfect opportunity as they'll get to go into other areas, other figure companies such as ESL, Faceit, uh, Gfinity and all such things. And some of them, like even esports figures, go into development of games as well, like uh, Creative Assembly. Some of my friends who are former Team Dignitas have gone into Creative Assembly who are bigger around the, the South Coast anyway, somewhere in, uh, I believe, Horsham. There's so many opportunities in esports as it is, and it's just going to get bigger and bigger. And slowly but surely, we're hopefully going to be one of the best universities uh, doing esports.